For the second video of our Korean New Year's Day series, I'm going to cook Dongtaejeon, which is frozen bolakjeon and sanjeok. Let's start with the ingredients. You need some flour, frozen bolak, any kind of meat or ham, yellow radish, we call it tamuji in Korean, crab sticks, egg, salt and pepper, vegetables like green onion, chili pepper, and carrot. You can also add some mushroom to it. And also you need your skewers. If you don't have skewers, then you can use the toothpick instead. In Korean grocery stores, they sell something called sanjeokgochi, so you can buy that. So, let's start cooking. First, I'm going to take out the frozen pollock from the freezer and defrost it. When it is completely defrosted, I'm going to season it nicely with salt and pepper. The frozen pollock is called dongtae in Korean, and they are sliced nicely so you can make chun with it, and you can buy them easily in Korean grocery stores around the holiday times. Once I season, I'm going to leave it in the refrigerator for a few minutes so it gets seasoned beautifully. Let's get our vegetables, ham, and meat ready. You're going to chop the ingredients around the same length. If you can chop it perfectly in the same length, it's fine, it looks beautiful. But if you can't, or if you don't want to, it's also fine. We usually use either ham or beef, but today I'm going to use both. I have no idea why my pinky is like that when I chop things. I really can't control it. When I'm done cutting all the ingredients, I'm going to put them on skewers or toothpick one by one. There's no exact order for it, so just make it colorful. I have my sanjeok and frozen pollock to be cooked, so sprinkle some salt into the egg and whisk the egg. Turn on the fire, make sure you don't put it in a high heat so it doesn't get burned. Pour in some cooking oil onto the pan. We are going to do just like what we did to the tonggarangdang last time. Put the frozen pollock into the flour, put it in the egg, and then on the pan. And you repeat the same thing over and over. You hear the sound? This is why Koreans eat chan a lot on rainy days. The sound of chan being cooked on the pan sounds just like the raindrops. I'm going to put the sliced red chili pepper on top to make it look colorful and give a point to it. When it's cooked thoroughly, you're going to put it nicely on the plate. When you're done cooking frozen pollock, let's clean the pan and start cooking the sanjeok. Cooking oil onto the pan, and you're going to repeat the same steps as you did to the frozen pollock. I'm going to put some extra egg on sanjeok using my spoon to make the ingredients on the skewers stick better to each other on the pan. Since my sanjeok is all cooked, I'm going to move them onto the plate.
We usually eat sanjak and dongtaejeon without any sauce because they have strong flavors. But if you want the sauce, then you can eat them with the soy sauce. We have our dongtaejeon and sanjak on the plate. So let's start digging in. 맛있게 드세요. And 새해 복 많이 받으세요.